growing trend towards ecotourism will probably make Hernando County and the Nature Coast even more popular as a relaxing getaway. The wetlands, natural springs, and abundance of waterways leading to the Gulf are a gift from Mother Nature if you enjoy water sports. And you can try before you buy. Jim McFarlane owns a kayak, canoe, and scuba rental company and thinks his backyard is pretty close to Nirvana. We've got a lot of wilderness area. We're sitting right now at Bayport, which is the entrance of an estuary, tremendous estuary system that goes up our coast 18 miles uninterrupted except for one little island that's got some population on it. Wildlife Refuge is sitting in there, Chassawiska National Wildlife Refuge. So somebody that's into nature, birds, uh, manatees, and just paddling and enjoying the outdoor, this is an ideal place. The community itself, a third of the property in Hernando County is pretty much protected land. So we've got a nice environment that's being protected for the enjoyment of whoever comes down here to see it. Uh, everybody gets together and enjoys it. Beginners can come out here and just a little bit of experience on guided trips do great. We've got a low energy coastline, we've got tidal influx, but it's only about a three foot variation. So most anybody can get on it. There's not big monstrous waves that come in in this county. A low energy estuary with just a tremendous amount of wildlife. Jim is a graduate in marine sciences and is thrilled by the variety of wildlife out his back door, both above and below the water. Well, the bird population here is tremendous. You, you have great uh, blue herons, white herons, egrets. Uh, all the water birds you can imagine are around this area. Ducks come through the area. This is a big area for manatees. Year round we have a population of manatees that's off this point. You can usually find a pod of maybe nine of them. There's nine or ten more that are up the river. So we've got that as well as tarpon fishing offshore. Uh, redfish in the flats are just one of the, the greatest fishing opportunities that there are. Blue crabs, for somebody that's out here, you check the pier a little later today, you'll see people out there pulling crabs out left and right. So it's really kind of get down to nature area. The canoes and kayaks have that advantage because of the shallow water on this area. Our coast, as you look out across it, is dropping at about a foot a mile. Uh, we have a channel that's going through here that boats fit in, but most of the area, you're not going to get a motorboat into. Many areas, six inches deep, a foot deep, and that's where all the fish are. That's where the enjoyable part is. Stress reduction is one of the biggest things. This is a natural setting. You're getting out, paddling, low energy put out by you, so it's a relaxing day, reduces all that stress from the city. You get to kind of get close to nature. Nothing like a day like this. It's easy to see how your stress would melt away on a day like this. So we'll see you at the dock.